I practice this thing called Wing Chun Kung Fu. I've been doing it for a little over a year now. It's a very, it's it's very interesting art. I draw many business and marketing lessons out of it. I tell Remind many me never to owe you money, Ben. Well, I'm not going to say I'm at the point where I can kill anybody, <laughs> but it's it's been fun learning it. All right. There's this movie uh, that I watched just because it's a little bit about Wing Chun, and it's called Warriors 2. Now, it's not that good of a movie, okay? <laughs> it's like one of these martial arts movies. But there's a scene in there that I do like quite a bit. It's like eight minutes long where this guy is, this master is training this new guy on Wing Chun. And he make, he puts the new guy with, he says, I want you to spar with this more experienced student over here. Mm-hmm. And the experienced student traps the new guy, right? Like easily traps him. So the Sifu comes up. Sifu is just what, that's what we call the, the master. The sensei know, or whatever, right? Yeah, we just call him Sifu. He has a pin in his hand. He pokes the new guy in the, in the side. He comes up, he sneaks up behind him and pokes him, startles him, and ends up pushing that uh, the other guy way across the like platform. Startled strength. It, like, it comes out of, you, it's inside you. You just have to learn how to tap into it. Right. Now, when you are just fired, right? You're startled, right? Like somebody's startled. They're, they got a family to feed, yeah. especially if this is like out of the blue, right? Yeah. So you have a family to feed. You have bills to pay. You don't want, you have a mortgage to pay. Right now you have, which it's a sucky situation, but you have more clarity and energy and focus than you probably ever have in your life. So you can use that startled force to, you know, do something with it, or you can sit around and brood and do nothing with it. Yeah. 